We begin with breaking news out of Greene County. One person is dead, another injured after shots were fired at a home late this afternoon. It happened in the 1000 block of Davis Grove Church Road near Snow Hill. Family members tell Nine on Your Side a man in his 60s died from injuries and multiple bullets struck a six year old boy who was transported to Vidant Medical Center in Greenville. The Greene County Sheriff's Office is investigating the case. WNCT's Brandon Truitt talked with family members tonight and has more. Emotions are running high as a family tries to make sense of the unthinkable. Family members tell me that it was 60 year old Johnny Jefferson that was shot and killed this afternoon after an apparent disagreement amongst family members. Latasha Williams says it was her stepfather who was killed. Williams says a six year old boy was caught in the crossfire and is in the hospital at Vidant now in critical condition. It is unclear what led to the argument, but Williams said when she arrived at the home, she found her stepdad lying face down in the backyard. It's an outcome family members just can't seem to wrap their head around. No, I can't because he did. He gave the word to his grandkids. So, I mean, for this to happen, it just blows our mind. Like we never thought in a million years that this would happen. William says it was Miles Burgeon who was allegedly responsible for all of this. The family here says Burgeon has been arrested in Raleigh in the car. They say he stole from the scene and in the house behind me, family members gathering to remember a loved one as they pray for one little boy tonight. In Greene County, Brandon Truitt, not on your side.